What is it to be suspicious, my son? To think something bad about someone, to be suspicious about someone, or to suppose that someone is guilty when there's no proof about his guilt, or to tell wrong about the deeds of someone. Well, briefly, suspiciousness is to think badly about an innocent person that he or she is guilty, and then to act accordingly. Suspiciousness is a big sin. And Allah doesn't forgive it. There are no wrong actions unforgivable by Allah, except ignoring the unity of Allah, thinking there is another God other than Allah. Yes, Father, the right of the third person. Suspiciousness is also the right of the third person. If the person doesn't forgive, also Allah will not forgive. So we must ask forgiveness from that person for the sin that we did. Bravo, my son. He learns all the things we read. Can you give an example about suspiciousness? Yes, mother. For example, one friend crossed us without saying hello. We must not be suspicious about him. Maybe he didn't see us. Maybe he was in a hurry, or maybe he was sick. We must think good and not take the sin of someone and not to break someone's heart. Let me give an example to see if I can clearly explain what it is to be suspicious. Let's say we saw one of your friends sitting near some people drinking alcohol. This does not necessarily mean he was drinking too. Maybe he is sitting near them to explain to them the harmful effects of drinking alcohol. We have to think good thoughts about people and to give a good meaning to what we see. Actually, I have to give an example. Sometimes I'm angry with Ahmed, but this does not mean I don't love him. I want the best for him. When he is doing something and he can't judge the reality of it, I am angry. I want him to understand me and understand the important fact. Okay, Mom, will you be angry with me if I don't understand? It is important to be careful of what you do, Ahmed. You should take seriously what your mother and father says, okay? Okay, Dad. Okay, Mom. Dad, did you read all of these? Yes, my son. I read. You read all the books, Father? Muslims must read a lot. We have to read and learn and live the religion. First of all, we have to teach our children. Yes, Father. Come on, let's pick up the table. I'll help you, Mother. Come on. Hey, Brother Bear, how are you? Where are you going? Is that you, Brother Crocodile? How should I be? We're in trouble. I heard what happened. How fast is the news spreading? It's a small world. Backbiting spreads fast. It's very bad. Nothing complicated. You apologize to the bee and that's it. But I didn't do it. Come on, you are not an unknown person. Are you planning to hide from us? Everybody knows how much you love honey. I swear I didn't do it. Did you swear? Are you serious? You didn't do it? Oh, in the end, someone has to believe me. Wait, I didn't believe it yet. But you swear. Who did it? I don't know. As soon as possible, I have to find out who did it. Otherwise, no one will trust me, and they'll want me to leave the forest. Wait, wait. We'll find a solution. We have to find one. Otherwise, it's very bad for me. Where should I live in except in the forest? I'm a bear, right? Is there someone who hates you? I have to think about it. I didn't harm anyone. Actually, I did hit someone once, but that's a small thing. We're friends now. Think twice. I remember. There's the wolf. But we don't have anything to dispute. What is the problem with the wolf? But what can it be? I'm a bear, and it's a wolf. Since a long time ago, we know each other as enemies. My father was an enemy with his father. My grandfather was an enemy with his grandfather. And so it's still continuing. Can the wolf be the one who did it? But the wolf doesn't love the honey. Who loves honey the most? Bears. The ones like me love it the most. So who hates the bear? The wolf. So why did the wolf do it? But why? Because he knows all the blame will be on you. The wolf will damage the beehive and say that 
you are the guilty one. They will send you from the forest and the territory will be all to the wolf. Yes, so I guess the wolf did it. I'm going to go see that wolf. Be careful. Speak nicely. Try to learn what the story is. I have my methods. Usually they work. I'll hit that wolf and he'll be sorry for what he did. Please be polite. Try to compromise. If you hit him, then they will say you're a hooligan. Okay, okay, I understand. I'll manage. 